Hey guys, how's it going? Josh Spoon, The Producer's Kitchen, and I wanted to talk to you about five killer live packs that you can get if you have Ableton Live license. So some of you may know, if you're a Sweet owner, that with Sweet you have quite a few live packs that you could download. Um, with Standard, a uh, little bit less, and with Intro, even less. These are all available to you. Um, if you go to the Ableton.com site and go to your account, they'll allow you to download even more packs than what's in the core library. So today I'm going to show you five really cool ones that I think you should check out. All right, let's take a look. Breakbeats by Cutmaster Kurt. Cutmaster Kurt has a lot of uh, old school um, hip hop work that he's done and he's made a pack especially for you type of vintage hip hop people. So don't come at me saying this is only for EDM, Ableton Live is only for remixing. There's all sorts of stuff for everybody. And as you can see, it comes with 63 clips, 10 presets, 10 live sets. So those are, they also call them construction sets. So it's stuff built already for you that you can kind of mess with. Drum machines. Drum machines is a little bit different from the core kit drums that you may find, like the 808s, the 909, 606, Lin drums, um, the DMX they are multi-sampled in most cases. So for example, if you use the drum machine's drum racks, you'll get multi-sampled velocities. So they're gonna sample certain velocity ranges straight out of the box. So you just get better sounding samples than just using the core kit. Also, there's just a bunch of classic drums in here. So you can use um, a lot of the drums that are really popular right now, which are the 808s and the 909s, and um, the Lin drum, um, since Prince is passing, people are kind of resurging that as a, a drum to use. So definitely check out Drum Machines. It has a lot of great sounds in it. Guitars and basses. So it's on the Ableton producer forum on Facebook and someone asked the question, um, actually they said, uh, Ableton has no good guitar and bass um, samples or sounds. I thought that statement was crazy because uh, if you go to the site and download guitars and basses, there are multi samples of guitars and basses, and they sound really good. I've used them on a lot of stuff. I know people have used them on different things. So obviously, guitars are hard to replicate. They're pretty complex instruments, finger picking, strumming with MIDI, but it's definitely possible. And these have. Um, guitar instruments that have great effects chains that you can just drag right in. Um, there's samples uh, also that you can drag in. They have articulations of bass slaps and pops, mutes, short and long notes, slides and things like that for guitars and bass. So definitely check that out. A lot of great sounds. Do not underestimate guitars and basses. Loop Masters Mixtape. Loop Masters Mixtape has a ton, a ton, I repeat, a ton of samples. So definitely download that one. It's got construction kits, it's got clips, great loops, funky bass lines, all sorts of stuff in there that you can chop up, use um, in your tracks. Um, just drop it in a simpler and get rolling. Um, so Loop Masters mixtape, I highly, 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 highly recommend it. Max for Live Essentials. If you have Ableton Live Suite and you have not downloaded this pack, you need to turn this off and download it now. Max for Live Essentials will take your productions and your ability to do things in live to like a level that you did not know. They have a LFO tool, so if you've ever used the LFO in Simpler and wanted to use the LFO on some part that Simpler won't allow you to do it, you can use this Max for Live LFO for it. You can use it to automate the send, you could use it to automate the volume, anything. You can map it to pretty much anything. Envelope, you can have an, ex an extra envelope that can be mapped to anything as well. So if you want an ADSR on uh, the send again, or if you want it on the drive of the saturator, you could do that. ARP, uh, it's a new instrument with 9.6, bass 9.6 also, it has a lot of other new additions to 9.6. You just gotta download it. There's a lot of stuff um, in there that's very, very useful, very, very useful tools, instruments, MIDI effects, audio effects, all built in Max for Live, all free if you are a sweet user. Hope you guys enjoyed that list. Hopefully there's some things in there that you haven't noticed before. Um, definitely go to the ableton.live.com site 
log in, check out what's available to you. Um, don't forget to subscribe and to share and comment with whatever live packs you think should maybe be in the next list or just sharing ones with other people that you think are really awesome, um, whether third party or ones that come with your license. I'm Josh Spoon, The Producer's Kitchen. Talk to you later.